Okay guys, so again, I am recording this after an hour and a half worth of gameplay, which I actually don't think was very good, but we'll find out when I edit. So anyway, getting back into Starfield, <laughs> making my way kind of clumsily through it, so like subscribe all that jazz and i will figure it out as i go so anyway here we go i just wanted to start out by saying i realized i made some mistakes in my last video and part of that was editing all of my mistakes out uh i think i should have left some of the things i learned in the video so i'm gonna try to do that going forward uh like learning uh, where the weapons go and so on like here if you go to weapons uh, let's see you can load them into your favorite slots so what I've done is I've put the pistols up rifles to the left health down and melee to the right just to kind of make that a little quicker um, also, I came out and I needed to get some XP before I go do a lot of fighting. I think I'm going to do it anyway. We're going to try it. So, what I've got here is we have to deal with this guy. So, I think I've got this thing 50% done when I came back outside. Uh, so, I'm going to go back in and see if we can deal with them. Let's see how far I have to go to find myself some combat and if he's going to follow me yeah there he is okay I'm still pretty much in the beginning stages of this game and I kind of want to get into the meat of it. Which means I'm going to have to do some fighting. Okay, I think this is where I was. I Ooh, do grenades. not understand your attachment to all these objects. Oh, med pack. All right. Maybe I didn't have all this stuff. Can't get in there. Okay, well, I feel like Nope, nice Okay. I 
I believe there's people up there. Yep. What? And here we go. I have detected hostile while the enemy is approaching. Okay. Wait, hold on. Before I go very far. Credits. Okay. Who else did I kill? <laughs> oh, there he is. Another axe. Let's make sure we get everything here. Okay, robot. You're getting in my way. Okay, I'm not sure. I'm just picking stuff up. Credits. Okay. Did I get this guy? Nope. And another Grendel. Wow. A lot of credits. Another Grendel. Okay. I'm sure I'm gonna miss stuff, but uh... Ooh. And we have a lab! Okay, so I don't have enough for that. I do for bandages. Nope. Oh. Yep. That's it. Okay. Oh. Aluminum. Analgesic. I'm probably going to wait a while for the, uh, to use the skill points and, uh, crafting. Because for one, I don't know what I'm doing. Still, I'm kind of learning. Raisin Bran! That's product placement. Okay. All right. Listen up. Someone's trying to kill my score. Hold them off here. My broken set up on the roof. I'm on it. No one's getting through. Uh. 
I am currently hidden. <laughs> oh, there they are. Okay, that didn't work. What? Get him! <laughs> Expiration requires so much bloodshed. Uh, hold on. Oh. Let's get out of here. Are you kidding me? I want to, uh... Here we go. Detection of enemy has dropped unexpectedly. Begin search protocol. Really? They bolted. All right. Enemy activity in the area has ceased. Cool. Oh, notebooks. Uh. <clears throat> So, where did they go? Oops. Hmm. Easy pickings. Easy pickings. Caffeine. Oh. oh I've not gotten one of these yet. <laughs> is that it? Or is it... This one. Not that one. Oh, wow. Okay. Hmm. Three options on this one. I haven't figured these out yet. 
I am supposed to have the security upgrade. <coughs> I don't fully understand. And that one is... Nope. Backwards. Wow. There is a new helmet. It would be advisable to leave some things behind. Okay. <laughs> Not sure what he means by that. Um. Captain Morgan, we should continue. Am I currently in possession of an item you require? No. Not really. Oh. Okay. Um. No. Okay. Is that the doorway I need? He's standing right in it. <laughs> Can I? Oh, I'm detecting I need it. a safe nearby. We could make use of whatever is inside, provided you had some digi picks and a disregard for personal property rights. I get it. Um. Oh. That's the first I've seen of them. Nutrient. In other words, we're gonna eat it. All right. So is Vasco telling me that I can steal? Ooh, a chisel. Thought that was a uh, screwdriver. Oh no. <laughs> That's about the only the only one, isn't it? Uh-oh. Okay. No. Are you kidding me? There we go. Steroid-based performance enhancer designed to temporarily temporarily boost leg strength. Nice. Credits and a digipick. Nice. Okay. An onion? Okay. 
Where am I going? Oh, what's this? They're dead. We're all dead. The comms relay has been trashed. The whole room is trashed. We can't call for help. I can hear the terror morph roaring somewhere. And more people screaming. Hmm. <laughs> Um, now that makes me wonder if I should go back and try to unlock that one. Where was it? Where was that, um... Oh. Dude. A little touchy. Okay, uh, where was that? Oh. <sighs> Wasn't that this room? Now I don't see it. I wanted to see if I could unlock that other one. You know what? I think I just need to go forward. Nope. Roof access. You will not be able to walk at full speed with your pack that full. Okay. Bolstering deep mining space helmet. Rip shank. Isoconcentered magnet, copper lead. Okay. Right. How do I throw a grenade? Did you pry the ship keys out of his cold, dead hands? Uh... Let's try we this. We have a problem with Barrett. We want that ship, the Frontier. If you're the captain of it now, that means we're after you. Hmm. Try that. Oh, no. You see, maybe your colleague Barrett didn't tell you, but there's a bit of a legend surrounding that ship. That constellation keeps treasure hidden in the cargo bays, the loot from a hundred planets, and it's going to be ours. That statement is partially correct. The frontier <laughs> has been to many planets and moons, but the only things held in the cargo bays are spare parts, dust, desiccated food particles, and a variety of species <laughs> of ant. I don't care what kind of lies Barrett programmed that robot to say. We're taking that ship. You're not talking us out of this score. Okay. 
To persuade a person, you need to make successful choices. Choices can range from kind words to distractions to threats. Each choice has a difficulty. The, oh, okay. The higher the difficulty, the greater the chance the choice fails. But the more points you'll earn when you succeed. You have a limited number of choices you can make, but you can never fail if your last choice succeeded. Okay. Oh, here we go with the persuasion. You have it wrong. Constellation is an explorer's group. They aren't treasure hunters. Um, okay. Three turns. Hey, if you want to trade ships, that sounds good to me. The frontier creaks when it turns anyway. Uh, let's go with this one. Don't give me that. I know that ship is stocked with loot. Oh. The ship doesn't have anything on it. You're chasing a fairy tale. Don't think you're walking away from this. Hey, if you want to trade ships, that sounds good to me. The Frontier Creeks. When it turns anyway, I just made it past your entire crew. Ooh. He's got a point there. So you got past a few rooks. Who cares? <laughs> no. I'm not sure. So X is auto persuade. Okay. So far, I'm not doing very good. <laughs> um, let's see. Maybe this one? You're willing to give up the ship? Just like that? Hmm. The ship doesn't have anything on it. You're chasing a fairy tale. Because I've already told him I'd give the ship up. Hmm. You're lying. We're getting what's on that ship. Uh oh. I failed. Are you kidding? Take him down. Are you kidding me? Okay, that was rough. We need the ship? Is that what you're telling me? So, here we go.
Okay. Okay, this is looking promising. 20 XP. What am I doing? Hey, Bosco. What? No parrot? Let me guess. Protocol ethical again? What am I. Huh? Oh, there it is. And here's our new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship. And you can stop by the trade authority kiosk if you need to offload some cargo. Okay, um, a thousand credits. My ship needs some repairs. I'd like to modify. Uh, let me see what ships you have for sale. Where did you say I could sell things? Oh, that I need. Okay. The Trade Authority runs a vending kiosk next to my booth. It's just off to the side, near the ramp. Besides that, Jemison Mercantile is your closest shop if you're looking for a bit of everything. That's further in, past the security checkpoint. Okay. Uh... Okay, crew for my ship. Viewport. It'll be on your left once you get into the plaza. Uh, let me see what you have for sale. I'm sure you can find something you like. Okay, so here's the Rambler. Ah, product placement. There's a bit more in the back if you're not seeing something on display. All right. Hi there. Thanks for stopping in. Feel free to look around. I can take care of transactions, and if you've got questions, just ask. Okay. Thanks. It's hard work, but it all pays off in the end. And I can't take all the credit. Gerhardt, my business partner, he does so much of the work behind the scenes. If it weren't for him, I don't know where we'd be now. Okay. Oh, please, take a look. Fifty-eight seventy. I don't even have close to that. Okay. Ooh, I'm not even sure what all I'm carrying. I know I have these. All right. So Arthur Morgan now has his hat. <laughs> this is my new outfit. Anywho, after messing around a little bit, uh, let's let's go. Hello. Check that outfit. Hello. Okay. Take a week off and they'll give you a raise. Um. Anyway. Let's keep going. Okay, can I talk to him? You see that scientist out in front of mast, staring at trees, 
sounds upset. Whatever it is, it can't be that bad, right? Okay. Talk to the scientist by the tree. I thought that was the, uh, no. Okay, I'm lost again. Okay, so one small step. We have to go to the lodge in the mass district. Um, nope, hold on. That's main mission, right? Yes. Faction miscellaneous mission activity. Talk to the scientist by the tree. Show on map. Okay. That's the lodge. <coughs> Talk to the scientist by the tree. Okay, so it's marked now. I get you. Yet to be discovered. And yet to be discovered. Now, do I get those by talking to someone? Because that's what just happened with this one. Talk to the scientist by the tree. Okay. Well, we know this is the mass district. Does it say? Is that also the mass district? Could be. All right. All right. Thanks for the tip, buddy. Okay. No people joke. So those Varun zealots worship a snake. But yep. Let me tell you, it ain't a snake. It's some kind of celestial being. They call it the Great Serpent. It's right. Real hell if I know. But they think it is, and that makes them dangerous. So it was one of the character traits you could have picked. Uh, during character creation was the people th that worship the snake or whatever it is I don't know the details exactly I didn't pick that one um, can we just talk to randos whoops can't talk right now sorry well what about this freak Look at him. Va? Va? She and not. Okay. He's speaking in other tongues. What about you? Oh, hey, what's up? What's up? And this guy? Kind of busy right now. Oh, hi. Right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't, oh, don't mind my robot. How are you? I am well. Hope New Atlantis has been treating you well. Yes. Bother me. Okay. You? Dang, he sits kind of close. Bit of a close sitter. Hi there. New Atlanta sure is shiny. It is shiny. I'm busy at the moment. Oh, all right. Oh, where was that? Oh, there was a kiosk. Um. Let's see, I already sold a bunch of things. 
I can't believe that I had to drop a bunch of crap to fast travel. I could have sold it. Hello? Hello? No? Alright. <laughs> you, tracksuit. Wouldn't want to live anywhere else. Oh. Uh, excuse me. All right. Je vous demande pardon. It says 23:30, right? Robot learns to lie. We'll know by the size of their nose. Interesting. Don's roost has the best food in the settled systems. Oh. Okay. Um what about this uh, info kiosk? Welcome to New Atlantis. Welcome to the city of New Atlantis, capital of the United Colonies, and for many, the settled systems as a whole. You stand now in the in the most technologically advanced city in the human race. Um. Okay. Mystery, corporate directory, directory, other buildings and services. Okay. Sanctum Universum Church. I can't remember. Okay, so there's House of Enlightenment. That was one of the uh, character creation picks. Freestar Collective Embassy. All right. Let's get out of there. A universe of leisure. Let's travel. Now, the mass district is where we're supposed to go. I'm thinking we need to check out these other ones. <clears throat> First, that is. Ah. Now this is... What did I say? Residential? Yeah. Right? Keep your nose clean. Last thing I want is to charge you for a DP, an A and B, B and E. A DP? I don't think I like the implication. Pioneer Tower. Jerry is by far the best flavor of them. Come on, Sava. Let to eat their own, I guess. Jerry is my jam. Jerry is his jam. Hope you're not agoraphobic. No. It wasn't even Dickens. Nothing good comes from the well. I heard that. I always wondered what the inside of the lodge looks like. Oh, okay. <coughs> All righty. Look at this bunch lounging about. So after an hour of whining, they're finally out. It's oh. a beautiful day today. Be My beards are wiped. I wish they just took a nap or something. Oh. There's no one to play with. At least they're outside. There's no one to play with. Oh. All right. Oh. Oh. 
Nope. Nope. Put that away. Hey there. Hello. 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 Gotta run soon. I'm late to a meeting. Oh. Okay. Um, let's see. I think that's enough for now. How do I get out of here? Ah! Somehow now I discovered it. Is this the... Oh, here it is. Now let's check out the uh, map here. Is that here? No, it's here. Residential district. Oh, okay. Now it's discovered. Okay, so this must be commercial. Let's check it out. Commercial district. A bat ball? Valberg. Oh. Okay, that was weird. Must be Seattle. Here's the coffee. Infinity. <laughs> Get it? Infinity Limited. <laughs> Oh, that's a good one. Infinity Limited. Oxymoron. Okay. Can I get some coffee? Hello and welcome to Terra. Oh, how may I serve you? And there are two locations in New Atlantis. Uh, what's your favorite thing? This corporate policy requires me to state that everything Terra Brew offers is my favorite. I can see that. Times change? Certainly. Please take your time. Um. Okay. I'll say, so, uh, but get, we have a cappuccino, which I used to drink quite frequently. Uh, a classic. What's a cortado? Uh, we have espresso, latte, and macchiato. That's a tough choice. I typically just drink black coffee anymore, but, um... Let's have a macchiato. Who needs coffee? I okay. need to report back, but this is very encouraging. Oh. Can I take a carrier? No, let's don't do that. Um. Oh, is this a... Uh, okay, that's where I came from. Let's see if I have discovered this area. something here oh okay I'm just gonna run around a bit that's right See that. Sorry, can't talk. Okay. It's people with a bunch of briefcases. Hello. Hello. Have a good one. Okay. 
have two if they're small. Uh, is this on the map now? Yes, it actually is. Okay, so now we can go to the mast district. If I can find my transit dealio. Where did I come from? Oh, no, put that away. Too much RDR2. <laughs> L2 to talk. Um, how's your coffee, dude? Hello there. Okay. Um, settled Systems News Network. Hold on a second. Okay, I'm headed the right way, I believe. Was it this way? Yep, there it is. Sorry, dude. Ah. Uh, so here we are. No time to chat. Nobody has time here. Not quite sushi. Oishi. <laughs> I still can't get over that. Infinity Limited. How's it going? Hi. Okay. Um, map again. Wait, what's this? Oh, the scientist by the tree left. Okay. It this way? I honestly feel guilty. Yep, there's the tree. Don't mind me. Okay. Gorgeous weather today, huh? I can't yes. get enough of all the trees around here. Okay. Are you from New Atlantis? No, I'm from Neon. Neon. I moved here a couple months ago for a job at the Office of Interstellar Affairs. Okay. Thanks. Maybe I'll see you around. Uh, do you work around here? Yeah, I work at MAST in the Office of Interstellar Affairs. I'm a sort of liaison between the UC and the Freestar Collective. Okay. I help solve communication problems, show visiting diplomats, the city, things like that. Probably doesn't sound all that exciting to you, but I love it. I've been interested in a diplomatic career since I was a kid. Okay. Is, is that it? Chief Diplomat Yassine runs a tight ship at the Office of Interstellar Affairs. Okay. I guess that is it. Um. Alright. Who left that broom? Right in the middle of... Oh, two of them. Repairs. It's like this pool is inoperative. All right. 
Okay, let's go. And there it is. One more jump. Here we are. The lodge. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. Okay. I messaged the other members of Constellation. They will be waiting for us inside. Okay. Your suit is protecting you from environmental damage. Okay, well, so far... Everyone will be in the library, just inside. If Barrett were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now, and he hopes you'll make this place your home. Well, it looks pretty homey. I like that chair in particular. And there is a lot of wood. Oh! Can I go up there? Can I go up there? I want to sneak upstairs. Door locked. I don't have the key that I'm aware of. What is this? Interesting. The Apollo. I can't take that. That's United States property. Let's go. Well, hello. We appear to have a visitor. That's right. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Uh, I'm not even sure, to be honest. Um. Okay, I would like to get to all of these. Pirates attacked. Barrett asked me to deliver the artifact. No, that's kind of rude. Who are you? Why don't we start? Who, who are you? Sarah Morgan, chair oh, of Oh, I'm Arthur Morgan. That means anything you discussed with Barrett is my business. Now, if you would please uh, answer my question. Oh, that's funny. Okay, pirates. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Uh, True that. This is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Yep. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. True. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. True. Thank you, Matteo. Now, let's focus on what's in front of us, shall we? Uh, what you're in front of me, actually. Distracted. Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? That thing almost killed me. <laughs> uh, it was bright lights and music. Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience, with less embellishment. Uh, I don't embellish. Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. But honestly, country, if you expect us to believe in fairy tales. If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus? Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. Right, let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Okay. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have, 
The artifact. If you could place it on the table here. All right. That's it. Just like the others. And to imagine, we thought there were only two of them at first. Oh my god, that's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. That energy that's arcing between them, no manufactured material in the settled systems can do that. None of them. This proves Easy, that girl. Breathe. You will have a heart attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, that means there's a set. True. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Maybe. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Patrick? Oh. You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting, now would it? Maybe. Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend here? <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? All right, I'm in. Tell me what happens next. It's a little much. How much do you know about the artifacts? What are they? Let's start there. Individually, they're just odd hunks of metal. Another oddity from the uncharted reaches of space. As to what they are, what they're building. Well, you'll be part of solving that puzzle now. Okay. All right, uh, you want me in Constellation, what does that mean? What's expected? We're all here <clears throat> because we're committed to exploring space. Humanity may have settled the stars, but that doesn't mean we should stop diving into the unknown. Beyond that, you'll be expected to use your own judgment, just like the rest Scary. of us. Scary. What happens next? You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but you'll meet them soon. Come find me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here, <coughs> I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. Sweet! In addition to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Just mind your head. Bonus. 400 XP. One small step. Join a constellation. All right. Can I, uh... We've always considered ourselves explorers, but this really is uncharted territory, isn't it? That was intense, wasn't it? The artifacts, I mean. Sorry, this must all be a little overwhelming for you right now. Nah. I guess a lot overwhelming, now that I think about it. I'm Noelle. It's really nice to meet you. And thank you for bringing the artifact to us. It wasn't easy. A place for me to stay. You seem to know a lot. I was wondering about other types of exploration work. The vision I saw, what do you think that was, and how long? Um, okay, let's start with... Oh, gosh, no, I mean, that's that's flattering, but really, we're making this up as we go. I excel Until at flattery. You arrived, we only had the two, and the vaguest sense that there was something more at work. There's still so much we don't know, and that means a lot of work ahead of us. Okay, let me know how I can help you learn more. I was wondering about other types of exploration work. Oh, right, that. If we're approaching this rationally, I suppose we'd call them visual and auditory hallucinations. What you perceived as lights and music could be overloaded neural input. Your brain's attempt to make sense of something an energy surge some other phenomenon well lsd will do that to you this wasn't random synapses firing it means something whatever i saw and heard it wasn't coming from me sure i'm not trying to suggest otherwise i wasn't there when it happened i'm just thinking it through okay that's okay now that this has happened to both you and Barrett, 
we can know to maybe expect it in the future. Be a little more prepared. We're all in this together now, right? Okay. Uh, let me know how I can help you learn more. Okay. Well, right now, nothing's off the table. Metallurgical analysis, chemical composition. I'm looking at everything. One thing I'm really trying to improve is my overall database of xenobiology. I don't know if it will help in this case, but the more we know about, well, everything, the better off we are, right? Speaking of, if you're going to be out there looking for more artifacts, you're bound to come across some interesting specimens. Anything organic, I'd be happy to take it off your hands. Okay. There's a galaxy chock full of resources. I know. The more data I have, the more thorough an analysis I can do. And if it sweetens the deal, I can pay. Pretty well, Always. too. Walter's pockets may not be bottomless, but they are pretty deep. I wouldn't know. Okay. I've got some organic resources for you. Great. Let's see what you have. Okay. I think I sold it all. <laughs> okay. Uh, does this count? I think that's it. I got rid of everything else. <laughs> okay. Okay. Of course. There's plenty of planets out there that no one has ever set foot on, and everything we learn about them is valuable. We have a board where we post anything specific we're looking for. A type of alien flora or fauna, or a planet with a specific quality, like if it's primed to have life but doesn't yet. Sweet. Planning on sticking around then? Good. I think we can find a spot for you. And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated tour. Okay. Follow Noel. When's the last time you went up to see Vladimir? Huh. Guess it's been a while. Why? Oh, I just don't know how he does it. Up there all alone for so long. Some people love that kind of space. Pun intended. Of course. It's been quieter around here ever since Vladimir went to live on the eye full time. Well, Constellation's been around forever, more than 50 years now. But we only became aware of the That means I've been around forever. Barrett discovered the first one about two years ago, right under our noses. And he was the one who got this all in motion. It's a shame he isn't here to see this. Indeed. I already did that. All right, let's stay safe, okay? All right. Um. So, Noel, constellation living up to your expectations? Absolutely, Sarah. I've never regretted the decision. You've Why is she looking at me? Valuable asset to the group, <laughs> Noel. Just wanted to make sure you didn't regret it. It's not always easy, but I just remind myself that if it weren't for you and for Constellation, I'd have no idea that any of this was going on. All right. Sarah is the best possible person to be running Constellation in a time like this. Focused, no nonsense, and dedicated. All right. Was that him? Oh. Hello. Fancy sofa. No, I'm not sitting. Uh, as much as I love, I'm, I know everyone's excited by the artifacts, but we need to be as objective as possible and be aware of possible negative effects. I already gave some... Anything I can learn from is a help.
Okay. Oh, maybe that was it. Okay. See you later. All right, how am I supposed to follow her if she doesn't move? Uh, check out the Constellation Mission Board. Oh! Investigate brownouts in the well. Talk to scientist by the tree. I thought I did that. Maybe that wasn't the scientist. And to Sergeant Yumi. Okay, well, actually... I think I'm going to stop right there with what I recorded before in this little part, which was much better, I might add. I think that's going to be enough for one video, so I'll see you for some more Starfield later on.